let's change this popular to featured product okay you may ask me or you may say that I can simply remove this port and type a uh, featured product yeah this one would be good and it will work but this is not perfect no way to handle multi language if you do it and this hard way so PrestaShop again help us and bless us with a beautiful feature called traduction so to do that we need to go to again back office then localization translation then we select the front office oh, so a type of translation we have a drop down list containing front office translation back office error message and solid model PDF translation and email template in my case I will select installed installed model because I would like to change or to translate a uh, text coming from an installed module not from the default thing again don't bother so much this is not such complicated uh, stuff or things in uh, PrestaShop so again select your fee very simple then check or select the language and in my case I will pick English I hit modify so I may get some uh, problem about my PHP setting maybe I will pause the video to fix that and I'll be back as I could so in case you have the same problem you need only to change a little parameter or you know some sort of uh, setting into your uh, PHP door INI and change or on command this line max input variables into 2000 and restart your Apache if you are on local or normally if you are on a hosted server everything should be okay without any problem so let me refresh I guess I do not get the port open yet okay refresh and it's take a bit of time because uh, we still have we, need, we still need to add more lines of blocks Setting config php ini and max input force. Let's give it ten thousand. Okay. Then now I have a very long page containing all almost all my models and um, my models with uh, the word to translate. So you might ask me how PrestaShop detect or find the words to translate on each model simply in the in the in the syntax you will get back to the template we saw this l equals uh, l then s equals to popular and the mod this is a keyword called mean model home feature so to change the translation of this word again as i said we need to go to back of translation select the translate and installed modules and select the, the, the language in the case on this case I picked the English version then we look just we need to firstly we expand all these um, the fields are to be able to search then we, if we do not found it in the on the right modules as here as home featured we simply need to type the word and just looking uh, it will be there type featured product uh, as translation featured products and we don't need to change anything on the template so simply it will be translated automatically and just refresh and our translation or our new translation will be there and there we go so product a featured product uh, okay it's well then now we need to change the background the font inspect her again okay this is in featured so is there any class we have home featured so let's add this class name firstly let's see if is it possible to change it from other place we have home featured tab again we are working under global CSS so let's remove this background we need to change the color for 333 three, three. okay then I think we don't need any right white background 
right there. So firstly, we need to save this into line 6495 global CSS. We go 6495. Then actually it should be this color. Sorry, so this should be the color. We don't need this. Okay, we can keep the padding. Then now uh, we need to remove this white background. We don't need it. Again, we are under a global. So let's go all this line 6416 or 60. 6460. And remove this background. Also, we have, let's say, different font. So in my case, I don't have the PSD. So I will, let's say, I will give it an Arial font family. Font family Arial. Okay. Then I change the font weight to 400 or maybe 300 mm. okay maybe we need to change directly to the A okay then font weight 300 and seems good so this one is 6497 6497 okay and paste this one okay so refresh and see what we have okay we still have some white background and we're good to go again we need to edit this icon mm, well for me I, I I would pause the video to find an icon then I will be back <clears throat> so I set up it an icon for you know for the test reason to have something there and uh, it's, there's it's not a big you know, just uh, uh, but a font awesome icon and uh, okay, <laughs> it's not really perfect, but uh, you know we we have something similar to what the template require. So also we need to add a little text here. I'll type P and uh, just type some lorem text. Okay three or four words mm, maybe we need to change uh, some CSS let's assign a class of small then okay it's this layer so this is it small and let's give it font size 1 em then font uh, transform or text transform sorry transform normal ah oh, yeah maybe I've got to trans text transform none okay capitalize look well or none uh, okay I can okay I'll stop there for this report let's save this into again global dossier, dossier assess.